Recording right? now, in even progress. Even property investor yourself, you're also leveraging on banks' money, right? To buy property, okay? Right? Anthony, ask partition to finish, but the bucket you covered by us. Depends, okay? There are few uh, ways to do that. You can cover it on your own or you can get landlord to do it your, for you, right? So usually you get landlord to do it for you, then you have to pay a bit higher rental, okay? In the workshop, I share with you three rental strategy, three rooms rental strategy. And a lot of people don't, don't know about this. Even subletting, there are three different types to do it, okay? Three different risk level, three different ways for you to, to uh, do room rental strategy, okay? I'll share with you because I've done all these three, yeah? Whether you need to pay your own money or you don't have to pay your own money or whether you are, you are uh, doing profit or I will share with you how we can do these three different techniques, okay? Now, let me share with you uh, a video of uh, Sharini of how she actually are able to grow 12 units in just one year. And I, let me tell you, she's actually earning more than me per unit, okay? Uh, she will review it in the video and how she actually, uh, how subletting changed her life. Okay, so let's uh, let's take a look at this video together. All right, here we go. Uh, kami, saya dan husband ya, uh, buat uh, sublet ni kami start dengan uh, buat buat sendiri lah, pandai pandai sendiri tak perlu flash pun. Sampai uh, unit keempat lah, unit keempat kita come across uh, class Uncle James, kita terus attend, and then lepas attend tu memang cepat lah sebab kita se sebelum ni kita buat kita tak sure kan betul ke, tak betul ke, salah ke. So bila kita dah attend class tu kita kita lebih tahu lah kita 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 dah tak ada try and error dah, so kita terus kita, kita dah tahu dah jawapan dia. Kenapa nak eksperimen lagi kan kalau kita dah tahu hmm. proven, proven, uh, sukses macam tu kan. So daripada empat sebelum uh, attend class, now kami dah ada dua belas unit lah. Wow. Dalam masa berapa lama tu Syari ni? Empat belas bulan. Wow. So sekarang ni net income berapa tu? Net income. <laughs> Average eh, average, average lah, tu, average. Uh, se satu unit about uh, seribu hingga seribu setengah. Wow. Uh, average Gila lah. Average. lah. Uh, Covid ni slow sikit lah. Ah, so you all kira lah sendiri eh. Dia ada dua belas unit. Satu unit net profit dia lebih daripada seribu. So you all kira sendirilah. Okay let's malas nak kira kan. So sebenarnya uh, Syarini, uh, sebab ramai orang kata buat sublet ni susah. Susah kena guna modal yang banyak, kena apa sacrifice hidup kan, nak kena layan komplain. So Syarini sendiri macam mana? Apa you punya pendapat tentang sublet ni? In general, uh, rasanya pendapat tu salah lah kalau nak kata tak ada life, susah. Dia, dia tak susah. Apa-apa bisnes atau apa-apa kerja pun ada ada pro and cons dia lah. But in general benda ni saya, uh, apa, sublet ni saya rasa dia sangat mudah lah sangat. Because kita buat benda tu mungkin kita busy sebulan pertama sebelum kita selepas kita ambil unit tu lah. Uh, lepas tu hmm. dah tak ada apa lah. Once tenant dah masuk it's just like routine maintenance sajalah. Uh, and especially kalau you ada komitmen lain kan, you bekerja ke. So saya rasa sublet ni sangat, sangat sesuai. Especially for women kan, kalau macam you nak jaga anak, macam for my case, I have OKU sister. So I, I tak boleh hmm. kerja, I tak boleh 9 to 5 punya kerja. Uh, hmm. So I, I, I have to, I, I pilih benda ni lah. Uh. Wow. Yes, many of our students are like uh, Sharini. Okay, that is now earning more than five figures of rental income. All right, she's even earning more than me. Many of my students are earning more than me per unit. Okay, but if you must know the strategy to do so, you must know how to do it. There's a system for you to do so. You cannot simply just break it. All right, and it can be done time and time again. And also, how subletting has actually helped change our lifestyle. This is one thing that I really love the most. And Sharini also shared how she she is she is she is able to get more time. Uh, take care of OKU sister, you know, take care of her family, and she doesn't even need to leave the condo, okay? Doing this business, a lot of our students, they are doing, doing it in their very condo itself. You don't have to go out, drive to be a grab delivery, you know, uh, going elsewhere. You can do this in your condo itself, all right? 
not just me, not just Rini, but many of our students uh, have been earning five to six figures of rental income uh, using the system that have been taught to them. But on the most right, okay, Irene, she is a full-time single mom. Yeah, she's doing it in her own condo itself. She doesn't even leave a condo, right? She's also earning five figures of rental income. We have Miko in the middle. She's a full-time mom. She's also doing this uh, uh, rental uh, subletting uh, full-time, all right? And how this actually helped her to spend more time with her family. We have people, we have students, right? We have uh, business people, we have accountants, people from all walks of life, okay? Investors or full-time selector, they have been using this to improve their lifestyle and also earn more side income using the system, all right? Using, uh, doing subletting over here. All right? Now, if you are still not convinced that subletting is amazing, right? Let me give you three more reasons. Where do you find a business model that you only need to sell one time, jual satu kali saja, and guarantee you sales for 12 months, right? You need to sell one time, okay? And guarantee sales for 12 months, bounded by contract, because contract says you need to pay for 12 months. Where do you find a business you only, to need, you only need to work for about two hours per week, okay? Not two hours per day, uh, one week, yeah? Uh, one week, you only need to put two to three hours. Okay, that's it, that's it. And most importantly, what I personally love the most is at the end of the day, you have freedom. Not just financial freedom. Financial freedom is a given. Everybody also say like, financial freedom are here, so more already, right? But more than that is really time freedom, right? Who loves time freedom, say me? Who wants to have more time freedom? Okay, now I could have easily earned five figures of rental income, uh, five figures of income doing corporate work. I could have spent eight hours, 10 hours a day uh, earning five figures, but what's the point of that, all right? To me, I don't mind even earning less, but have more time freedom so that I can spend more time with my loved one, my, my friends and my family, right? And that's the reason why all this while I have not worked in a full-time job before. I was a freelancer and then, and then I do subletting, right? And because I understand, uh, I, I love the time freedom. I enjoy it very, very much to be able to spend time, to be able to be where I want. Especially when you grow up, uh, you will realize time spent with your family is, is really very precious. Nothing that can replace that. You can, money you can earn back, guys, really. Uh, let, let me tell you this. I'm not saying this to what? Money you can earn back. Time you can never earn back, okay? Especially what happens now, a pandemic, a lot of people, you know, it makes me realize even more that spending time with your family and loved one is really important, okay? No matter what you do now, guys, spend more time with your friends and family, right? So subletting allows me to do that. I'm very blessed to be able to do that. Whenever my family needs help, I can just go to them, take them to hospital. I can to attempt to them, right? I can, I, can, I can do a lot of things to help more people. So this enables us. And these are also the reason why a lot of people are into this. But the reality, let me be very frank to you. The reality is not a lot of subletter or sublet entrepreneur is also enjoying this same amount of freedom. Why? Because the truth is a lot of operators or sublet entrepreneur is losing control over their business. They actually spend more time managing this business. All right? They keep on coming to us and say, hey, Andrew, how come I'm not getting uh, this same amount of freedom, right? Uh, you know, I see you very free one and your home also you can manage, but I end up having to spend more time going to the house, la, I wash the toilet bowl, la, I go and fix the toilet bowl, la, right? At 12 o'clock, my tenant call me, la, 3 o'clock, my tenant call me, la, all right? How do you manage all this? Okay. And that is also some of the things that a lot of investors is having doubt going into subletting because they hear a lot of things from the market or from those who, you know, who, who failed in doing the business. We call them sublet myths. What are some of the things that you probably hear? Okay, what are some of the misconceptions? I call I call it a southern myth. Lah. What are some of the things you hear that probably deter you from starting to do sublet? Okay, first one, you say you're very difficult to find tenant. Lah. Right. In fact, actually, the first one is you hear subletting is illegal. That is the first one. 
right? You also hear that you know it's very difficult to find tenant. Now you hear from people, your furniture very easily get destroyed. Actually, this is completely opposite. I hear that you know you are, you had to spend a lot of time. You know they will call you after twelve. Not true. Ah, uh, difficult to collect rent. Troublesome to keep a bad tenant. Uh, different tenants sure fight. Your house will get dirty and messy. Tiring to having look for tenant. Uh, maintenance all very troublesome. Managing five five tenants in the house is nightmare, and so on and so forth. So all these things that you hear <laughs> from the market or from people who have not even done the business that that is even worse. Like I'll call this sublet myth. All right, because these are not true. These have been experienced that by people who have not been able to successfully done this business. Now, if you want to go to a business. You want to do this business? Who do you ask? Do you ask uh, people who failed in the business, or do you ask people who have not done the business before, or you ask people who successfully managed the business? All right. So ask from those who successfully managed the business, right? And let me tell you from our experience, these are all being experienced by uh, the operators because they don't have a system. They have no ideas what they are doing. Okay. And most of all, let me tell you this secret. What, why, eighty percent? Okay, why, why a lot of people? Why seventy percent of operators actually fail in this business? Okay, why a lot of people say they can't do? Why a lot of people complain about this business? Because a lot of operators actually see themselves as a landlord. All right. Ah, what do you mean, Andrew? What do you mean, landlord? A lot of us have this mentality called the landlord mentality. Now, I'm gonna admit. Before learning for SK, I also have this landlord mentality. Now, what do I mean by landlord mentality? Now, those of us who have landlord mentality, all we care about is beginning of every month. All we care is when we take out our phone, we see our tenant got pay us or not. Wow, this one got pay me money or not, rental or not. Okay, open up my bank account. Wow, see, got the rental money comes in or not. That is all we care about. We don't care about the quality of life of our tenant. We don't freaking care. We don't bother. We don't bother whether they die or they live in the house. We don't bother whether uh, should we give customer service or not. We, we don't care. All we care about is money, money, money. Now let me tell you this, guys. If this is all you care about, if you have this landlord mentality, you will fail in this business. Let me say it one more time. If all you have is this landlord mentality, you will fail in this business. Especially more true in this pandemic time. Let me tell you later a bit more. All right, now, what then should we do? What should we have? You should instead see yourself as a entrepreneur, regardless of whether you have only one unit or two units or three units, or you are managing fifty rooms, a hundred rooms. You must see yourself as an entrepreneur. Okay, you must treat this as a business. Okay, let me tell you. Once you do this, it shifts your entire paradigm shift. Once I learned this, it changed my entire paradigm shift of how I actually do this business. Because then you don't see your tenant as tenant. I don't. We don't call our tenant tenant. You know what? Should you call them? You should call them your customer. They are your customer. And when you see this as a business, every business must have what? You must have a business plan, right? And every business plan you must have all this. You must have due diligence. You must risk assessment, budgeting, marketing, right? Customer service operation. A lot of you don't even have this all, huh? Budgeting, got me. Customer, huh? Need to give customer service, ah. Operation management. That's why you all spend more time doing because you don't have operation system, you don't have a way, you don't have a SOP, you don't have a crisis management. When crisis hits, then you kill them, kaboot. You cry father, cry mother. All right, you don't have plan, you don't have strategy for your marketing, sales, branding. That's why you don't get tenants. Especially more true in this pandemic, guys. Now. I'm I'm in the mood now. Let me tell you a few more secrets. Especially at a time like this, what you what you should focus more is not just sales. Sales is just twenty percent of the equation. You should focus more on tenant retention, customer service. Okay, these are the things a lot of people never teach you. They won't tell you out there. A lot of people focus on the wrong, uh, wrong thing. You just want sales, 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 sales. You cut in, all right. Then you don't care about your tenant. No, 
right? Especially at a pandemic time like this, you must focus even more on taking care of your tenant. If you don't do that, you will struggle in your business, right? You will fail in this business. And that's the reason why in, in SKA, we teach people ethical way and we teach people very different way. We teach you to really take care of the tenant. You have to, okay? And you must have a plan. If it's a system, if you fail to plan, you plan to fail, right? You must take this, guys. You must go back and have a planning. If you don't, uh, you will fail. So tonight, if you don't have a plan, you whether you have one house or two house, you must have a plan. You must treat this as a business. You must have an SOP. And all this system and SOP is what allows you to grow and skill, just like all this restaurant. Okay? How many outlets do they have? <laughs> they have thousands of outlets, am I right? Right? Whether you are in KK, whether in Johor, whether in Penang, we have thousands of outlets, KFC, McDonald's, even though their founder is not around already. But because they have a system, that they have the right recipe, the right system, they are able to still grow now they're able to still skill wherever it is they are successful in the business. Okay? Right recipe, right system will ensure your success. Yeah? Now, this is also how I did it. Okay? Now, I, I you know, looking, at, looking back at what I did, I am feeling a bit uh, ashamed of what I did, but I want to be vulnerable and share with you because not everything we do, I do is all rosy. Okay? Now, let me tell you, before I learned from SKA, uh, these are some of the rooms I set up. Uh, I was actually already managing 50 rooms, okay? I was doing it alone. I was doing it in the dark. I have no idea what I was doing. I was just swinging. Like, I was just pretty much swinging because I thought how difficult this could be, right? Do sublet, slap on a partition, and just do that. But then after a while, I end up, you know, starting to face a lot of problems. I started losing control of my business. My tenants are leaving. And my, some of my rooms are vacant for six months. My tenants call me 12 o'clock, a lot of complaints. I don't know how to handle. And I was alone. And I don't know what to do, how to handle all this thing. Okay? And I was really losing control. I was in the sinking sand. Then I remember again. I still remember I was Albert Einstein said. He says, you can't be doing the same thing again. If you do the same thing again and expect different results, that's insanity. So I tell myself, I have to do something different. I have to reach out to someone who has been there, done that, who is willing to coach me, who is willing to pull me out of the sinking sand and show me the right way of doing this because I don't know how. I don't know. How, I, don't know I have tried everything. Okay. And that's when I have found Subliking Asia. Okay. I have heard of Subliking Asia. I have heard of Uncle James. I learned from Uncle James. And I have applied select income system. And since then, I am able to drastically change my strategy and change what I do from 50 rooms that I manage from what you see back then to 150 rooms. So pretty much 100 rooms in just one year time. Uh, and we drastically change our entire system and our entire planning to how, it, how it's looking uh, uh, now, right? To give us a much, much better system that we are now able to not only increase our rental you rent out much faster, uh, have a much better system. Our tenant love us. They refer to more people, right? And we have landlord who always come to us to pass us unit. Yeah. In fact, I wish I've actually learned this before I start my first 50 units so that I could have avoided a lot of mistakes. Until now, I am still rectifying some of the mistakes. For example, the wrong bit, wrong bit frame that I bought that now I have to spend more time to go and change it, more money, right? And uh, something that I, you know, the wrong chair that causes even accident. These are all serious because I don't know. I have never learned. I don't know rental. So these are some of the things that landlord, we all did. Lah. We thought, you know, we just buy this or we thought just buy the cheapest one. Lah. You end up, right? You spend more money down the road. You end up, you could cause accident down the road. And the wrong partition I did, the wrong setup in the house, wrong tenant filtration, wrong tenancy agreement, wrong landlord communication. All this give me a lot of troubles down the road until now for my early units. So I wish I've actually learned this before I started so that I can avoid so many troubles, right? Now you don't have to, you don't have to learn, really. You, you don't have to go to the workshop, you don't have to learn. You could do it on your own, trial and error, right? 
you can you can do it. Go Google, you can go YouTube. There are many informations, no problem. But it's whether you are willing to take more time, more resources, waste more money to get there, or you wanted to shorten your, your road. All right, save more money, okay? Uh, learn from the mistakes and get there faster, right? Because a good system shortens the road to the goal. Yeah, let me share with you a video of Eason, all right? How he is able to use system, scale his room to 300 rooms, conquer an entire building, and to make him the endorsed accommodation provider, all right, recognized by MMU, right? If that's why in the open day, this one is in the, in, in the open day, he's able to open proof that. So these are some of the things that we teach also. How to get B2B contract, right? Not just doing, uh, uh, getting uh, from consumer B2C, but also B2B. Things are some of the things that we, 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 we have been teaching our students. So let's take a look of how Eason did it, all right? And his story uh, about this as well. So let's take a look at his sharing together. Here we go. The first day I met Uncle James, I just wanted to manage properly my existing unit, which is only three units, which I'm very happy already because I just want to make it run smooth and uh, fully tenanted and, and peace of the, mind. Pay the bank loan. And pay the bank, <laughs> the damn bank loan. Okay. <laughs> okay. Right. okay. So during the first day I attend Uncle James class, Uncle James share the insight of how to manage hostel, especially student hostel, which I have bigger dream. The first day, it already gave me a big dream on how to increase my unit to 10 unit. So I was, that day I was very happy. So I've, I've go back and can't sleep. The next day of the class, I have a better idea on how to get more than 100 tenants, which I was never think of, never think of. So that day, the second day, the third day, I have an idea how to achieve two to three hundred tenants to manage and to uh, do what step by step the process. So I was very happy. Uncle James gave me another break, which is I able to do my hostel in the whole block. I able to do whole block of uh, student hostel. That one totally blow my mind that time. And I also very grateful that Uncle James, he have inspired me on how to do. It's totally different on how to manage two hostel, 100 students until one block. One block is more than 500 students already at that time. So that time I was crazy. Yes, guys, if you want to scale, if you want to conquer the block, if you want to grow your, your rental business through 100 rooms, 300 rooms, or no, 100 rooms, you must have a system for you to scale. And I, and I can understand Eason as well. I, I too have the similar reaction after attending uh, Uncle James' course uh, back then, how, how I learned, you know, he's my mentor. I also have a shock, all right? And how we can actually do so much of these things, right? It, that, that I have not known before that. In fact, it has haunted me after the two days, right? So, wow, I can do all this. Uh, and and, and that, that is the things that we can do. But you must learn, you must have a system. You must be able to have a system for you to skill. If not, you won't be able to even survive one unit. Why certain restaurants, they can skill to five, 10, 20 restaurants all over the, the country? Or why certain restaurants, they book up three months, they chop up already, or they, they cannot work already? Because they don't have the right recipe, they don't have the right system. Yeah? Success really, guys, is, is not a secret. It's just a proven system. The system that works, okay, that you can use to get to your success faster. All right? Now, great. Now, I know that uh, the time is a bit running, but I wanted to build, uh, give you more values. Who want more values? Who want to learn more secrets? Say, say me. Who want, who want more value? All right? This is what our student learn, right? Now, we, this actually we only teach in our paid course. Okay, we only teach your pick cost, but I wanted to really deliver maximum value. And so at a time like this to help all of us to be able to uh, run our business better, I wanted to share this with you. This is a secret that enables a lot of our students to get waiting lists. They have tenant 
queuing up to want to rent a room, even before they got their key, even before they started renovation. And this is what enables them to test the market, test the water first, before they even start the business to see whether it got demand or not. Who want to learn this? Say me. Right? Now, here we go. Write this down, okay? Write this down, right? Write this down. You must learn how to do phantom marketing, okay? Write this down on your phone, phantom marketing. What is phantom marketing? Now, you see, a lot of us, yeah, we make the mistakes of not doing anything, especially property investors. After you got your key, then only you kurang kabut, okay? And you employ SMP strategy. You still remember SMP strategy? Now, in fact, some of you CMP, you cry and pray, all right? You pray for the stars, the moon, the galaxy to be aligned, and hopefully the tenants will fall from the sky and run from you after you have gotten your key. Hopefully, got demand. Hopefully, you pray. Okay, or some of you operator, you rent, then only you pray God demand. No, don't do that. There are many things that we can do before we gotten our call or before we go into a building to ensure there's demand. So what do we do? We do phantom marketing. Okay, listen to this very carefully. How? Now, we first do a phantom post. We call this a phantom post. You craft a phantom advertisement, an advertisement about the location, about the condo, all right, uh, you put in the condo, you put in the location over there, okay, in your, in your, in your advertisement, you get, you get a photo, and then you identify at least 20 Facebook groups, okay, you have identified at least 10 web platform, okay, can you find 10 website for you to do advertisement, right, find 10 website, 20 Facebook groups at least, and then you start advertising this phantom post in all these platform or, or all these Facebook groups every day for three to five days minimum, okay? Every day you post in all these platform, this phantom post, okay? You put it in the location, you put in the condo name, all right? And you advertise in this platform three to five days every day. Now, at the end of the fifth days, then you must check and you track how many people actually texted, texted you? How many people actually called you up? asking for rooms, asking about your room or interested in your rooms. Now, if after three or five days, no one texted you, no one called you up, what does that tell you? What does that tell you? Got demand or no demand? Got demand or no demand? No demand, right? It means people not very interested in this location, people not very interested in this condo. Do you still go in and do your business? No, right? No, you should be more careful already. Now, well, what if, what if there are people texted you or called you out asking for your rooms? What do you do? Right? Then you say, oh, thank you. Hallelujah. Right? Alhamdulillah. Thank you. Right? Be grateful. What do you do then? You must then, uh, that, that means, okay, first, it means the place got demand. The condo got demand. Second thing, you are also doing what? You are also collecting leads. Okay, you are collecting contacts. So those who texted you and contacted you, right? You must put them into a list. Write their name down, write their contacts down, okay? And gather them in a list. So these are all the people who is interested in your rooms. As soon as you have gotten your key, you done your, your renovation, you can already arrange for all these people to come and view your room. You have been you have saved so much time already, right? Every, single, every bit of time that you spend uh, is very crucial because guys, investor, yeah, you must remember after you got your key, right? The monthly installments start already. One. In, in fact, even before that, your progressive interest and all that, right? But once you VP, uh, your monthly installments start. The longer time you get your house to be filled up, the more, right? Every month that is vacant, the, every month you need to pay the bank loan. So you must... Make sure you are able to rent it out as fast as we can. That's why we will also teach you, right? How you can use the shortest time, how you can do renovation in just two weeks time, okay? In just less than a month, lah. two weeks. Usually what I did is about two weeks time, I'll get everything done. Another two weeks to get everything filled. So one month time, we will get everything done. But how do we do this? 
You must then do phantom marketing so that you, before you have all this, you already have a list of people to, to want to come and view a room. Right? So don't do that. Don't sit there and do nothing. Then start cry and pray. Don't use CMP strategy. Right? Now, Miko, the founder of Star Room, she also used this strategy. I was uh, one of our students. Okay? And this allows her to have a waiting list, people queuing out for her room. In fact, one day she came to us and she said, hey, Andrew, uh, guys, I am uh, very stressed right now, very sakit kepala. I asked her, what happened, Miko? She said, someone pay me booking fees. Then we were a bit puzzled. We said, Miko, what, uh, what, what do you mean? People pay you booking fee, you should be happy, right? Why are you so stressed? Then she said, guys, that is because I have collected booking fee, but I got no room to rent out to, to, to them. All my rooms fill out. I got no vacant rooms. And that is her problem that she's facing right now. Okay? So her problem is she got no vacant rooms. But people already pay her booking fees. She's managed, she managed to do this because she did phantom marketing. And she have a big thing list of people queuing up. Her problem is not whether got demand or not, got people want to rent or not. She worked the other way around. Her problem here is I already got demand. Now I need to find room. I need to find a place to fill up. Now, how do you feel in a business like this where you already have a demand? And that's why we are able to co convince our landlord even more because we, we already have a demand, right? So you must learn all this. These are the things, right? To give you more confidence in the business. And that's why during pandemic, during uh, you know uh, last year to this year, every month she is growing. She's taking more new unit, more owner passing her you need to manage. She's growing her business even through pandemic, okay? Because she already have demands. She just need to find a place to fill in. And so many of our students is also using these techniques. And of course, there are too many different variations. You know, I, we are running out of time. You know, I can't be telling everything here. Many different variations of this phantom marketing techniques. So how can you use this to even rent out your, your room much faster, determine different rental range and help you add more value and uh, test more things? Yeah, they help you test more things and be more successful in this business. Right? So try out this uh, phantom marketing strategy, guys. Okay? Right? Do you like this? Do you guys think that this is powerful? Do you like this? Do you like... Do you like phantom marketing? If you do, give me a yes. Right? Are you have you are you learning something so far? Or do you like phantom marketing? Or do you like what you have been hearing so far? Can you give me a yes if you do? <laughs> Let me know. Have you been learning something? Great. Great. Thank you, guys. Thank you, guys. All right. <laughs> You're welcome, CC. All right. Thank you, Niall. Niall, you are awesome for doing the summarizing for me. <laughs> All right. So really leverage, treat this as a business, phantom marketing, and you must have a business plan to do this. Okay, Lily? Yes. Yeah. And we have so much more to uh, want to share with you, but... Uh, we are we I, do, I can't do all this in this one and a half hour sessions. Okay, with that, can I have permission from all of you? Would it be okay to uh, spend the next five, 10 minutes to share with you a program that we have uh, that we will be teaching you more? Would that be okay? If that's okay, can you keep me in the okay? All right, would that be okay if I can uh, have five minutes or 10 minutes of your time to share with you the program that we have? Thank you. Thank you, guys. Appreciate it. All right. You guys are amazing. Now, I promise you that uh, this is definitely a very jam-packed, value-packed uh, program that I'm very excited uh, together with my team. We are very excited because I spent so much time crafting these, starting back then from Uncle James, uh, over 20 years of experience. This is not just my experience, right? This is a combination of my personal experience together with Uncle James, together with the whole team and our consultants jam packed with this entire program uh, that we have taken a lot of effort to craft for, for all of you. So we are very excited to share with you about this. Okay, now let's start. Let's start. All right. Now, guys, we have these two full days of a virtual workshop that will be done on Zoom. 
okay? Unfortunately, we can't do physical workshops, so it will be done on Zoom. So no matter where you are, you are on Borneo, you are in Penang, you are in Kedah, you are in uh, wherever Johor, you can attend this workshop as well. So it will be done on the weekend, Saturday, Sunday, 31st July and 1st of August. All right. Uh, if you can't attend this, we uh, we almost every month we will have lah. You just have to text us. Okay, it's in two full days, nine to five p.m. Uh, in fact, usually we will go more than two uh, five p.m. lah. Huh? <laughs> now, what do you learn? What would you learn in the uh, two days workshop itself? Okay. Now you will be getting the entire ultimate game plan, the sublet starter ultimate game plan, right from A to Z. Whether you are new, whether you are already doing this, whether you are complete new or property investor, you have A to Z for you to start this. Like what I have promised you as well, you also learn how you can have you know, in 10 steps to get landlords agree to pass the units for you to do subletting or even do renovation for you. Yeah. In fact, I have more than 10 steps actually. Now, tenancy agreement is also very crucial, yeah, guys. Please listen carefully. Yeah? Don't download it on Google. Don't just download it Google, put in your company name and then put it out. I tell you, <laughs> you have trouble. Now we'll teach you, even we give you our bulletproof tenancy agreement to protect your business. And I'll share with you how to achieve 80% closing rate for your room viewing. Okay, that means uh, 10 people come and view your room. Eight people will sign up. Okay, eight people will sign up. Sure, got two, one, two people won't sign up on huh? But eight people will sign up and that is an amazing, impressive rate already. So I tell you exactly what you can do that. Okay, we will also teach you five analysis to find winning rental property. How do we grow the 300 rooms? How do we get all this winning rental property that keep on having all this demand? We teach you three simple ways to make your tenants fall in love with you. Very important. Okay, you must have tenants fall in love and that's why we keep on having even have tenant referral now, right? Teach you very free tenant management. Tenants, because we want to do this business to what? To have more time, uh, okay? How do you do to help you save more time? You don't have to like 12 o'clock go and chuti jamban, all right? Or answer your tenant's call. Don't have to. None of our students do this. How to get people queue up for your rooms? Very important. Must have the demand, Right? Don't worry about demand. And especially now in pandemic, what can you do? Right? How do we do? How do we do? We teach you exactly how we do to keep tenants and also get more tenants. There are things that you must do now, especially in pandemic, to, to, uh, to, to convert sales. Okay? We also be teaching you cost effective and wow factor room furnishing strategies for investors. How you save costs. All right, we tell you exactly the whole list. What kind of chair to buy? What kind of wardrobe to buy? What kind of paint? What kind of table? Every single thing, room rental specific, we will teach you the entire system. From my experience, we even give you uh, the contact, the supplier. All right. So all this, um, two full days, okay? Two full days over. Over the weekend, we'll be sharing with you uh, about this. And not just this, we still have more to give you, all right? Not just these two days. Because we know, right, a lot of the time, we go and attend workshop. After that, what? 80% we lupa, we forgot. Then want to ask, don't know where. Want to revise, don't know where. That's the reason why we have created, okay? We have spent so much time to create. And, and to, be, to be honest to you, two days, that took up time to cover everything. Right, so they thought because we want to share with you as much as possible, so we have created this online university to share with you even more information that we don't have time to cover within the two days program. Right, so in this online university, you have tons and tons of videos teach you more about phantom marketing. We teach you how to do copywriting for room, how to do marketing, how to do advertisement, and also tons of practical videos where I actually bring you <laughs> to my, my unit, our students unit, share with you exactly how we, we set up our unit, how we, we uh, solve problem our unit, okay? Really bring you to our unit, a vlog style uh, video, okay? So don't want just to see, you know, the screen screen here, tell you the bullet point, uh, no use, be practical, okay? So this itself would have value at 3,688 ringgit ready, okay? Now we will give this 
part of it for you lifetime access. You can access this anytime, anywhere you want. Now, not only that, we are so dedicated to help you start. No point after the workshop, then you don't know how to start. Most importantly is you must be able to start. So we are shipping uh, this physical sublet starter kit. It's a physical box. We ship it to your doorstep. Now, what do you get in this starter kit? You will get our mastery workbook, all the jam-packed note information that we use over the four or five years of our experience at a workshop, refine it, give it to you. You will get ah, our time-tested, idiot-proof, sublet-centric tenancy agreement for your tenant, for your landlord. All right, that has been, uh, we have worked together with senior lawyer starting from 20 years experience, all gathered this. I tell you, you won't be able to find this anywhere. This itself is probably worth the value of the workshop already, okay? Now, most importantly, we want to help you be able to start right away. So we give you all done for you template, the entire system so that you don't have to figure it out all yourself. You can close your eyes. The next day, you can start running your business with system. All that you need will be given to you, okay? And we'll also be including some uh, uh, mysterious sublet business gadgets that every sublet entrepreneur you must have. Okay, so you'll find uh, more about it when you got your sublet starter kit. So it will be included in the box as well. Now, this whole sublet starter kit uh, is worth 7, 788 ringgit. Now, I actually think, you know, the tenancy agreement alone is worth more than this because if you get a senior lawyer to draft out for you, it costs you at least four digits, five digits. Okay, so we give this to you as part of the sublet starter kit. Now, Another thing that I truly love about this program, right, is our community. Now, don't do this alone, guys. Do this alone can be very, very sian one, you know, <laughs> very lonely. Yeah, just like me, when I first started doing this, when I have problem, I don't know where to go and ask. I, I am pretty much clueless. But come into a community with like-minded people where you have seniors that are now running hundreds of rooms, thousands of rooms, who is not, who is, who is uh, not, uh, who is selfless in sharing their resources, sharing how they deal with problems, sharing with you their strategy. We are always sharing with one another. Yeah? And also we constantly have a lot of uh, educations, free educations that we keep on uh, updating our alumni in, in, the, in, the, in the Facebook group. And in fact, a lot of us actually found our business partners and our friends in this community itself. So to me, really uh, a community like this, lifetime access is priceless, right? Now the two days workshop itself, the online university starter kit, Facebook group itself, all valued at 9,474 ringgit. Now, obviously you don't have to pay that, right? Who wants to pay this? No one to pay this, right? Now, no, you don't have to pay this. Today only, you only have to pay 2,498 ringgit. Now, hold on, hold on, okay? Hold on. I promise you, the next part will blow you away, right? I promise you, if you stay back, you will see values that is so irresistible because what I'm gonna offer to you, right? is gonna be amazing value. Now, today only, if you sign up the, for the workshop within the day itself, not only that you'll be getting what I have mentioned, but you will also be getting this amazing deal called the Lifetime Mentorship Program. Yes, you hear me right. And that is because we are so dedicated to make sure that you succeed in this business. Now, we only want serious people. Only if you really want to learn the skills to stop bleeding and want to get five figures of rental income, want to be successful in this business, we welcome you because we will be investing our resources, we'll be investing our time to personally coach you, mentor you until you are successful, all right? So what do we have in this Lifetime Mentorship Program? Now, first, you'll be invited to our Sublet Mastermind Group, which is our WhatsApp group. Now, a lot of the time after you attend workshop, right, you don't know where to ask questions. Sometimes you even have to pay 5K, 10K just to get the contact of the coach. Now, you don't have to do that. You, you, you'll be uh, invited to our Southern Mastermind group where I will be in the group. Our team of coaches will be in the group. Even our founder will be in the group. 
right? So whatever questions you got to ask anytime, anywhere, now not anytime, now, after 12, I right, preferably not. <laughs> we will always be there to answer every questions, everything that you want to ask. Now, in this, we shared so many things, so many resources, a lot of contacts, a lot of private deals, a lot of private resources, okay? A lot of supplier contact. Now, even people sharing. Do anybody have rooms in Sha'ala? Anybody have rooms or anybody uh, managing rooms in, in, uh, in some way? I have owner looking for operator to manage. Okay, so we are constantly sharing all these deals, resources. They help our members to grow, help our members to get more deals. Yeah, so whatever question you ask now, even some of our students ask, anyone got experience handling tenant who complained got ghosts in her room? All right, all these matcham matcham questions. I tell you, whatever you have faced, we have faced it all with our more than 20 years of experience in this industry. And we have a solution for you, right? You just have to ask and we are more than willing to, 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 uh, to help you up. Any chance to meet you face to face? Yes, definitely, CC. We would love to meet you face to face, right? Now, it's value at 298. Now, definitely, we, we will definitely want to meet you out. And that's, that's the reason why we also have this monthly coaching clinic that we want to meet you face to face. But unfortunately, right now, we can't do physical uh, face to face. So we are doing uh, mainly virtually. So every month, we will have a workshop. Okay, where we will have a session where you get to meet us, right? Even after the workshop, you get to meet us. Yeah, uh, you have any questions, you have any, we call it a hot seat session. You can even bring us your layout and ask us, hey, Andrew, how do I actually do setup? Uh? How do I do partition? Uh? How, how many rooms? Uh? <laughs> All right, we will even tell you how, what to do, where do you get your furniture? Now? How do you plan it? All right, what should you be looking for? We will give you a hot seat session to coach you to make sure you are able to successfully set up and avoid mistakes. You only need to come and ask us. That's it. We, we, we want you. We want you to attend this, right? Um, so in fact, right, previously, we, every month, we actually have our alumni days and, and more, more events going on. But right now, unfortunately, we can't. So we'll be doing mostly virtual uh, sessions, okay? This, if you sign up for the coaching itself clinic, it is valued at 6,000, right? But all this is being included as part of the bonus of our lifetime mentorship program that we were giving to you because we, we know that, you know, let's, let's be real, right? You could have learned, like for example, you want to learn swimming or learn badminton. You can watch thousands of videos on YouTube about learning badminton. You can go to Google and learn about badminton. But why do people still need a coach? Right? Why do you still need a little coach? Because you need a coach to show you how exactly you get there faster. What mistakes are you making? How do you avoid mistakes? You can do all this trial and error, right? But coach help you get there faster. So if you want to get there faster, avoid mistakes and spend even more money rectifying it. Now, every month you bleed 2,000, 3,000 ringgit. Okay? But if learning these skills help you to stop bleeding, get more positive cash flow and get there faster, this is our job. And we want to make sure you don't lose money anymore. Okay? Lifetime mentorship program. This is what we'll be offering. Now, all this, two days also, online university, tons of videos, right? Showing you what we do. Starter kit, the alumni group, our mastermind group, monthly coaching clinic, all this value at 18,460 ringgit. Now, obviously, no one wants to pay this, right? You, now let me tell you, what if, guys, who wants discount? Now, what, what if I tell you you don't even have to pay 2498? Who, what if I tell you you don't even need to pay 2499? Now, who really wants to learn this? But money is like, you know, <laughs> an issue to you. You want more discount. Who wants more discount? Give me five. If you want more discount, all right? Give me a five. If you want more discount, great. Now Malaysian all love discount, right? Now because we are now doing virtual workshop, now I promise you, I guarantee you, uh, if we do physical workshop, you won't be getting at this pricing. In fact, I paid more <laughs> than I first learned. Okay, I paid, I paid five k to learn from uh, Uncle James back then. Okay, and I promise, I guarantee you, physical workshop, you won't be getting this. Now, because we know. We are doing virtual workshop and we want to help more people. 
if you sign up by today in uh, in within 24 hours you don't have to pay 2498 now you will get a 500 ringgit early bird discount yes you hear me right a 500 ringgit early bird discount only for those of you who sign up okay by the end of the day you don't even need to pay 2000 ringgit right only 1998 ringgit with all the workshops all the materials the online universities and the lifetime mentorship program the coaching the hot seat sessions that we will be giving to you okay so quickly uh hit over to scan the QR code, okay? You can quickly go over, scan the QR code. If you can't attend on the day, uh, you can WhatsApp our admin, yeah? WhatsApp our admin, admin. We will give you an alternative day as well, all right? We have given you an alternative day, but uh, if you want this day, you have to be quick because it's taking up uh, very fast already because we I don't want to have too many people. This is a coaching session. I want to spend more time to help you, coach you, to help you get to there, get to where you want to get to. So we are not taking too many people as well, all right? So for those of you who are keen, right, scan the QR code, you can, you can actually go uh, to click the link over there, all right? Now, <laughs> let me tell you this. What if, what if I do something crazy for you guys? What if I tell you guys that we will be giving to you a 100% money back guarantee? Yes, you hear me right. What if we give you 100% money back, money back guarantee? Now, let's say after attending the workshop, right? After attending the workshop, you apply, you learn everything, you go to a hot seat session or mastermind group, you ask questions, you, after uh, applying, applying and implementing whatever we teach you, okay? Within 12 years time, uh, 12 months, yeah? After 12 months, the money that you earn couldn't cover the cost fee that you paid. All right. That means after 12 months, uh, the money you earn from subletting can't cover the cost fee that you pay, right? We will return every single cent to you, right? We will return every single cent to you. And that is how confident we are in our program because this has been tested time and time again, helping so many students. That's why I am so confident. If you follow the system, you will get there. All right. Why? Why am I so confident? Because if you took a look at 1998 over 12 months, uh, that means every month, right? You only need to minimum earn 166 ringgit. Now, if you follow our system, uh, you close your eye, you smell this, smell you do. Definitely a minimum also 500 ringgit. Uh. Minimum also 500 ringgit if you follow our system well. Okay? Sure. Now, with just an investment, monthly investment of 166 ringgit, to give you the potential to be able to earn five figures of rental income monthly. Guys, this is what 50 times your investment. For investment of 166 ringgit to give you a potential, uh, earn a semi-passive income of 10,200, five figures rental income. Consistent income, recurring income, a pandemic-proof income, right? And to also help you stop bleeding, to give you the skills to, to, to stop paying a goddamn bank loan from your own life savings. And this is a skills that you can use it for your lifetime, not just for your current unit, but for your future investment. You need to help you to be a better investor, right? With just 166 ringgit a month investment. Now, 166, you pay your, your monthly bill, internet bill, your, your uh, kids' tuition bill already, more than this already, right? Now, what if you say, no, Andrew, what if, what if you know, uh, I can't earn five figures of rental income, only lima ratos ringgit lah. What is the, that is the worst case scenario lah. What if I can't earn five figures, only 500 ringgit? Now, the worst case scenario is it took, it takes you four months to ROI your cost fee that you paid. Okay, four months, you will cover your cost fee already. And after that, the fifth month, the sixth month, the seventh month, the eighth month, you are still earning five, uh, 500 ringgit every month. You are still earning that money. Okay, and for your future units, you are still earning a positive cash flow. And remember, this is a lifetime, you have a lifetime mentorship program. Okay, because we believe every year, yeah, the market might change, things might change, right? Pandemic, no one expect this, things change. 
So we always share with you the latest strategy, the latest information. What should you do in pandemic? How should you gear up? What can you prepare yourself? Right? If your house got people infected COVID-19, what should you do? What are the SOP and the steps that you should do? We have the steps by steps to share with you. All right. So all the lifetime mentorship program, grab it right now. If you want to get in this uh, early bit discount only for those of you who sign up, right? Uh, by today, you get lifetime mentorship program. Also an uh, early bird uh, discount of 500 ringgit, right? It will be on the 31st of July and 1st of August, the two days uh, workshop, not just the two days workshop, but also a program, a lifetime program, a cold coaching as well uh, throughout you know, the, the whole time that you're attending, right? So we only have a few spots left. So if you have any questions or anything about payment or alter, alternative payment uh, options, you can contact our admin, uh, Nachwa, all right? Uh, she will share with you more about the, the contact, all right? So get it in, get in there, yeah? Give yourself an opportunity to learn a new skills. Learn a skills that could help you achieve new breakthrough in 2021. Now you can choose not to come or you can choose to give yourself an opportunity to say, hey, let's make an investment of 166 ringgit every month to give myself an opportunity to learn a skills that not only I can use for lifetime, that I can use to give me a potential to earn five figures or I can choose to go back to my old ways of living, to continue to be in a status quo, to continue to struggle. How do I pay my bill every single month? to continue to ask myself, how come I can't get out of this red race? How come I am still struggling, all right, of having to pay the bill? How come I am still bleeding every month? How do I earn more side income to help cover my monthly household, to pay house loan, to afford my kids' tuition and education with just a monthly investment of 166 ringgit? You can choose to do it on your own, all right? Trials and error, no problem. Or you can have someone who have, they have, been, have it then, been there, done that, to help you and guide you to achieve your goal and shorten your roads to achieve your success over there, right? And most importantly, how subletting actually changed uh, your lifestyle. And this is what I personally love the most. I was a freelancer. Anybody here a freelancer? All right, I was a freelancer in the event industry. Right, and if you have been a freelancer, you know that uh, income is very inconsistent. Okay, I do not know whether this month got income or not, next month got income or not, even if in fact next week got income or not, it varies, even though I got time freedom, but my income is very inconsistent. And imagine if I'm still a freelancer in the event industry last year, pandemic 2020, the entire year, right. The event industry is what is frozen. No one can do event. No one can do conduct event. No one can, can, can organize event, right? For the entire year, I've seen so many of my peers in the event industry suffered. A lot of them pivot. A lot of them do a lot of merit of different things. If I'm still doing that, I will have been getting a zero income from the event industry. And that is real. But I'm very thankful that I've started subletting a few years before the pandemic happens. And because of that, throughout pandemic, even MCO 1.0, 2.0, 3.0, that I'm still able to get five figures of rental income, right? I'm still able to put food on the table. I'm still able to cover all my loans. I'm still able to uh, feed my family, right? And be able to spend time with my family. And also blessed enough to be able to help others in need. Right, And that's the reason why we are so grateful and so excited to share this with more people because we want to have more people to be able to enjoy a business that could give you a pandemic-proof income, recurring, consistent income that doesn't require you to spend 8 hours, 10 hours a day to work on a business. That is the part I love the most. That's why every day, I wake up 12 o'clock, 1 o'clock, you know, and I tell my team, don't text me before 12. Uh, don't arrange meeting before 12. <laughs> Always have meeting after 2 o'clock, my lunchtime, okay? Because I wake up 12 o'clock, yeah? So give yourself an opportunity to 
be able to learn that and have that. Right? So if you want to join this family, if you want to join this lifestyle, you want to join me together, all right? And let me coach you, help you and share with you my experience on how I started from zero. Really zero, okay? Prior from starting subletting, I've tried myriads of different businesses, okay? You name it, e-commerce, drop shipping. okay? I've done it. I have done cryptocurrency mining, yeah? Back in 2017, all right? If you guys remember, anybody here invested in cryptocurrency, I invested, I've actually pumped in 150,000, okay? I put it 100,000 of my life savings as a freelancer a lot, huh? Into cryptocurrency mining, I borrowed 50,000 from my mom who just retired uh, back then, okay? And also my uh, my girlfriend back then, now wife, okay? I, I am thankful that she still married me. <laughs> all right, 50 ton of their money, put it into cryptocurrency mining and I lost it all. 150,000 just lost it like this. Back in 2017, uh, uh, I think, all right? Uh, because we all know what happens in 2018, right? The entire cryptocurrency, you know, tank, okay? I pretty much lost it all. And that was the point where, you know, I was so desperate. That was the point where I was really struggling. I lost all my life savings. I lost my mom retirement money. Goodness. I lost my wife's money back then. We worked so hard in a full-time job. And I lost it all. So that got me, got me, uh, venturing into subletting, right? That got me into venturing into subletting because I was inspired uh, by a place I rented back then, uh, you know, where the landlord actually converted uh, the living room <laughs> into a balcony room. So I see already, I say, hey, macam boleh buat, nah? So I then do it, okay? Duplicate it, do it next door. Then I keep doing it the next condo. That's how I started my first 50 room, right? If you still remember. But I do it without knowing any system. Okay, I do it, I just whack it, I just simply swing, I just redo it in the dark. Okay, so I thought, you know, I can do it. But after that, without proper planning, without knowing what I do, I start facing a lot of problems, a lot of troubles, and I don't know who to ask. I don't know whether this is the right, right setup or not. And I'm losing control over the business. And that's the reason why I found Uncle James, okay, and I started learning the system. Now, in fact, I feel... I had a culture shock after attended uh, Uncle James workshop back then, right? Because I was like, huh, all this can be done. Ah. <laughs> all this need to do. Ah. All this can be done. Ah. All right. And, and in fact, that is also a lot of feedback for my students. They was like, huh, <laughs> all this can be done. Ah. Right? They had a culture shock. But once they have learned this system and they implement this system, a lot of them come coming back, keep coming back and say, Andrew, thank you for teaching the system. Thank you for you know, helping us to set up that system. And now we achieve more success than ever before. Okay? You must learn long-term. What we teach you is long-term. Sustainable business, ethical, professional business. We teach you legal things, right? Professionally managed, not some short-term quick buck. That's why we say that this is business. This is not some get-rich-quick scheme. Not a click of a button, you earn money kind of thing. If you want those get-rich-quick scheme, don't come to this workshop. I don't have any of that for you. This is a legit business. If you want a sustainable business that can give you a piece of my sleeping, all right? Knowing that you are helping people. Remember, we, we talk about this business, you are actually helping people to solve problems. You're helping the owner solving their problem, helping them to rent out their unique, helping them to be able to cover their loan. You're also helping who? Young people. Young people who can't afford to buy a house, can't afford to rent the whole house, and yet they wanted a good place to stay in, you're helping them to find a comfortable room. These are also some of the things we teach you, how to do a, a five-star service sublet entrepreneur that your, your tenants love you. Okay, They refuse to leave. <laughs> right? And not only that, they continue to, to recommend more friends to come and stay with you. Yeah, that's why even during pandemic time now is even more important. The more you take care of your tenant, the more you will succeed in this business because your tenant will be the biggest referral if you do the right thing. These are some of the things that we will teach you also. How can you do the right thing? Right? How can you do the right thing? 
what are the things you can do, right? To keep your tenant, uh, very important uh, now, uh, you must keep your tenant. Yeah? Losing your tenant now costs you a lot, okay? So we will go through this. We'll teach you the techniques of how you can keep your tenants, how you can make them just like Apple, right? Apple, they don't spend a lot of money on advertisement. They have a raving fans. We call it raving fans. If you can build a group of raving fans, they will be your biggest marketing tools. That is one of them, okay? So learn all this or how you can do that, especially time like this in the pandemic, all right? Great. Now, so those of you already, you can scan the QR code or you can click on the link now. We only have a few, few spots left. Right, for those of you who are still kind of sitting on the fence, uh, not quite sure whether this program is for you, you want to hear more uh, case study, let me share with you a video interview I've done for uh, with Miko. And she shared, right, after attending the workshop, how it actually helps her business, her business, okay? From previously being in an e-commerce business, she actually jaw baju one, you know, uh, physical shops and all. How Subletic helped her in her uh, in her family lives, right? And how she is able to grow after attending the workshop, okay? So let's uh, hang back and uh, take a look at this video. If you are ready, you can head out for uh, the payment checkout page, all right? Here we go. Okay, Miko, when did you attend the SKA program? I attended 2019. 2019. Yeah. Since then, how has SKA program actually helped you in this journey? I think it helps a lot. I don't have any knowledge about all this subletting. And then now I've equipped myself with all this knowledge and I started right and I can do until today, this stage. So I think it really helped me a lot with all the USB inside, how I manage the crisis, all these things, it's already in my mind. I'm more confident to do all along the way. Another thing, we have this community to help each other. So whenever there is a problem, there is a question, we can ask in the group. And there are always other sublet operators who has been to, who has experienced this, willing to help. Yeah. So I think this is the beautiful thing in this community. What are some of the biggest learning points that you learn from SKA? I think it's the sublet knowledge first thing because there are a lot of people think that sublet you just add on the partition if without the knowledge you do not know you have to plan first then only you start everything yep. so this is the most important thing another thing I think is you have to really care about your tenants mm. this is the important thing that how I managed to sustain during the pandemic and all my tenants 80% uh, renewing rates and then the third thing I have a lot of uh, ancestors <laughs> no, not ancestors those <laughs> senior senior senior. <laughs> senior then when I see them they can do well then I'm more confident that actually I can do it also yep, yeah, yeah so I'm following the steps to start it right and then slowly build my own empire because sometimes when you attend courses already after the courses they will say bye bye to you lah. <laughs> so you whether you start or not to start it depends on you already where else in SKA um, you, when you face any problem during the journey, you have people to consult and then uh, we are helping each other to grow. We are more than happy that you are able to success in this sublet journey. Yeah. Now, after attending uh, the workshop, right, who do you think should be attending this workshop? For those that you want to have some extra income, for housewife, maybe you would like to support your husband during this pandemic. I know it's not easy. Mm -hmm. Maybe you can start a few units first to get the extra income for your family, for your kids. Yeah, because you don't even have to leave your condo to do this, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, true. And you still manage to take care. You can take your kids to the <laughs> You need to help you start out. Yeah, my, my elder son is helping me to do the start out wow, sometimes. Wow, yeah. all right. Did you pay your son? Uh, buy him meal. La. <laughs> he loves to eat. <laughs> all right. All right, yes. All right, that's uh, how Miko, you know, after attending the workshop, she's able to uh, really grow her business and to understand the foundation of doing this is also very important, right? And why we do this because uh, a lot of investors, a lot of owners themselves, they are also doing this because they realize the potential in this, 
especially in the coming next one to two years, guys. Okay, I'm going to give in to you to this. A lot more opportunities coming, right? As I tell you guys, there's a big market out there. More units that will be coming into the market. A lot more VP unit, a lot more owners or investors that is needing help, right? To manage their units. A lot of new VP unit that, it, that, that is going to come, okay? In the next one to three years time. Now, this is the opportunity for you to, for you to grab it out. Okay, not only just for uh, those of you who are investors, even better because you invested in that unit, in that building already. Why not also help other investors to do so in that building? Okay, you have even more uh, advantage of doing that. So I will teach you as an investor, as a property owner, how can you even use that to leverage it and, and uh, conquer your own building? And also for those of you who just wanted to you know, uh, use this leverage on people property, you can help all these investors. Yeah? And we all know that nowadays property prices is you know, it's getting higher. A lot of youngsters, a lot of young people, they are not afford, they can't afford to buy a house. Okay. A lot of commitment, a lot of expenses right now. A lot of people can't afford to buy a house now. So their next natural cost of action, okay, their choices when they come to work, right? They need to go to work, they need to study and all, right? Is to what? Is to rent. Is to rent a house. So you must study the target market of your audience. You must know who rent house. Okay, yeah. So if you know the target market, you must always know it's about what? It's about 20 to 29 years old. Now, in fact, we have been starting to see the trend. Okay, more 30 years old, 31 years old, 32 years old. Okay, renting houses now because a lot more people now can't afford to buy houses. So more and more people can only afford to rent house or rent rooms. Right, so the demand is there, right? And you have the stocks coming in, and you need uh, you have a lot of investors that needing help. So this is really a successful concussion, a right time for you to for yourself to get prepared, equip yourself with the asset management skills, the right strategy, the right system for you to start growing and venturing into this business, whether you are a subletter yourself, you do full-time, you want to scale, you want to grow, you want to learn a proper system to do this. Okay, very important. Or, you know, I know that a lot of, uh, we, we, we do have a lot of students who also already started 300 rooms, 400 rooms, but yet they still attend our workshop because they also want to learn how our system goes, how to learn it, uh, do it even more effectively, efficiently. Okay, there are always things that you can learn. And also some other operator who is not earning, uh, doing 10 rooms, 50 rooms, they want to learn how I can scale to 100 rooms, 200 rooms. How can I have a system to manage this? Or even just investor, right? You want to learn a system to help you to manage your own unit, okay? How you do manage your own unit, your five rooms or your three rooms or your four rooms and how you can also leverage this to grow in your own investment unit to help other investors, right? Or, you know, you are just a stay-at-home parent, single mom, single parents, you can also do this because you don't have to leave your house. You can be in your condo. We have so many single parents doing this, all right? Uh, helping their fellow property, uh, uh, property owners in the same condo, helping them manage, okay? And, and it's even better because you're in the condo yourself. You know, we'll teach you even more techniques of how you can do this, what kind of location, right? How you can do a proper management skills, how do you talk to other landlord? I will teach you 18 things you can do to convince landlord to pass you their unit to manage. What can you do? I have a share with exactly 18 things you can do. And that's the reason why, you know, even until now, a lot of my landlord, they, they uh, have been recommending, introducing a lot of their friends, right? Because, you know, investor, they have a lot of investor friends. They keep recommending their friends or pass their units to me to manage. Yeah. So at the one point I say, you know, I can't take it ready. We pass this to the, to the students to manage. Yeah. So your landlord is your business partner. It's your very valuable business partner. So how can you get them on your side? All this, we will also be teaching you. How do you communicate? How do you get them to be your business partner? All right. Great. So how are we different? 
right? We definitely, it's all about practicality, no theory. If you like theory, this is not your workshop, okay? Learn from someone who has been there, done that successfully, and most importantly, no upsell, all right? There will be no upsell. It's not going to be you coming to the workshop. Let me tell you, okay, guys, we have another part two. Just have to pay extra 5K, 10K for some advanced technique, right? Nope, no nothing. That's why we offer you as a bonus, a lifetime mentorship program to give you more advanced technique, to help you sharpening your saw, to give you more tips, right? We won't be charging you for any of that after that, all right? It's a lifetime mentorship program, no upsell, right? So if you're ready, you can scan. If you have more questions about the program, you can type in the comment in the chat box if you have any question on the program. Or you have any questions you, uh, you know, you're a bit shy to ask here, you can also text uh, our admin, uh, Nachua, all right? You can text Nachua to, to ask more questions, all right? If you have questions about the program, you can ask it uh, over here as well, all right? Okay, now this, this is for me. Now I've talked about this already. If whether this is for you or not, definitely you not know, booking adult operators, stay at home parents, completely new beginner. Absolutely. This is how I started. You know, I, I tell you guys, I I haven't invested in prop any properties, you know, I was just a tenant in the house, right? I have no knowledge. I wasn't a property agent or anything, right? I started as a complete new beginner. If I can do this right you can definitely do this, yeah? I will share with you how I started from scratch, how from zero, how you can build this from nothing, from zero, zero knowledge to be successful, okay? I'll share with you step by step. If you're a complete beginner, definitely for you. And it is exactly because of subletting that allows me to borrow money from bank to be a sublet, uh, to be a, a property investor, okay? All right? Now, as I've promised uh, all of you, okay, that we will be giving you our feasibility analysis for high-rise property, a free ebook uh, for all of you. Thank you so much to 25 of you. Congratulations for still staying until 11 o'clock now. All right? I hope you learned something. I hope you enjoy the sessions. And uh, we want to fulfill our promise because you have been awesome. We will be giving you the free ebook for uh, here. Yeah, we will attach uh, the ebook and the Zoom chat over here in a minute time. I uh, mean, you put it over here. So if you can't download it for some reason, you can also WhatsApp our admin. She will send it to you personally as well. So in here, you will find like uh, five pages of uh, criteria and questions. Okay, environmental impact analysis. Look at the macro environment of what you should be looking at to assess whether this building is safe for you to go in and do your business or not. Okay. You look at the rental building impact analysis, the building itself. What are some of the things you might, must look at? Landlord impact analysis. Ah, all right. Just I've, I've been telling you guys, landlord is your big business uh, partner, your stakeholder. We must do your landlord impact analysis as well as your hidden dangers impact analysis. What are some of the hidden dangers you should be look out for so that you don't have to spend so much time and resources investing in that building, right? And after that, down the road, you realize got, oh, hidden dangers. Yo, this one actually like this, this one actually like that, right? That's the reason why we are able to successfully conquer a building skill in that building, okay? Because we have done proper due diligence, we have done our analysis. Now, definitely we'll be teaching you more in the workshop on this, okay? All this must, you must learn, right? And we will give, you, give this to you for free. And also 25 more tips as well in the in the in analysis in the free ebook, right? So uh Nashua, when you're ready, uh, you can attach this ebook, yeah, to uh to them. Okay. Attach the ebook for them, right? Uh, in a short while, I think she's still uploading it. If you can't uh, uh download it for some reason, you can also WhatsApp admin. Okay, if you any questions on the program, you can also either ask me here or you can also ask uh Nachua as well all right guys thank you so much for your time right please stay safe continue to follow us uh, our ska uh, subject asia facebook page we constantly have more information more 
a workshop coming in, right? If you uh, enjoy this workshop, you think that your friends could benefit from the workshop, you can also introduce to them. Uh, almost every week, every Wednesday, we also will have, we have this workshop, all right? Uh, you can recommend, you can, you can, you know, you can introduce your friends to come and join us. Yeah, if any questions, you can PM us, you can text us, right? You have anything, you can just text us. So thank you so much for joining us. Have a fantastic evening. Stay safe. Stay safe, all right? We'll see you in the workshop. Uh, it is uh, 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 end of July, right? And I will be ending this session by showing you this video, right? More video if you want to have a sneak peek of some of the things that we will be teaching you in the workshop, all right? Yeah, Mr. Alexia will share with you more, right? So with that, I will end this session with this video over here so thank you guys so so much for you know spending your two hours with me you know until 11 o'clock right here i appreciate it and i thank you so much for your time if you enjoy the workshop you know if you want to leave me some feedback or comment you can also do so in our ska page right and i will see you in the workshop take care stay safe everybody Hi everyone, I'm Alex. Uh, I'm a contractor, a sublet operator, and I also Uncle James student. So, uh, contractor is a family business. So, last time uh, when I was uh, doing a contractor business, so it was uh, we need to get sales like, all the time. So, if we don't get sales, uh, we lose our bread and butter. So, it was a hazard. So, it was uh, every day we have to fight for the sale. But then, uh, after that, I come across something sublet, a room rental business. Okay, so it allows me to see that there is a potential to get a semi-passive income or recurring income. That means I do the renovation for one time and then I get the return every month. So that opens up my mind. When did you start doing all this uh, sublet business? Uh, I started doing sublet two years ago. Okay. Uh, two years ago. When we first started, we actually have uh, four partners. Uh, we run a, a sublet business in a small town called Banda, South Jana Putra. So there, was a, there is a university there, Masa University. And uh, it didn't turn out as well as we thought it would. <laughs> so it was, uh, there were a lot of hazard. Uh, basically, we have five houses here, uh, five houses there, and uh, around 30 to 40 tenants like that. But it was a hazard to manage them. Why? So people come in, people go out, and then okay. they, they make the place dirty, they destroy the place. So a lot of work needs to be done. And actually, I'm the only one who is uh, managing it. Oh, so right. everyone will, call, will be calling me all the time. And then uh, I have to solve their problem, uh, basically, even at night, you know. Okay. So calls keep coming. So that was before I attended uh, Uncle James' class. Uh, so that time, I thought this was the way of dealing with the sublet. Uh, because I just do what I thought was right. Uh, but that was also the time when I decided to attend Uncle James' class and then he taught me something You taught me something that is really impactful I think it changes the way I see a sublet business, business. Okay. Because you talk about uh, how to provide value to tenants in terms of building community Not just renting a room, not just providing accommodation Not just trying to sell a five six hundred ringgit room But actually give them value How? By uh, by make sure that uh, they have a better service So uh, after I attended Uncle James' class, he taught us something very powerful it's called a welcome dinner. Okay, basically, um, a lot of people, a lot of tenants, they complain that because they feel that the owner is not taking care of them. They didn't provide them what they're supposed to be. Like for instance, the lights, uh, the oil is broken, it's not maintained well, the aircon is damaged. But they don't have a proper channel of communi uh, communicating. But Uncle James taught us something like welcome dinner. That means when tenants actually fill up a house, we actually organize something like welcome dinner. And we get to know all the tenants. And they also get to know the person who is uh, taking care of their unit, like our cleaner, our maintenance guy, and then they get to meet me, meet the agent. So we get to know each other well. He really practiced what I teach him. So by doing that, uh, actually we solve the problem before the problem happens. Because by doing that, even if they have complaints and things like that, they actually know the proper channel of, of lodging those complaints. They know who to look for, and they know that uh, it's not okay to complain to us after working hours. So we make it very clear, and we also explain the house rule so that uh, if there is any problem in the future, they know who to contact, they know what is supposed to be done and not supposed to be done in the house. If there is an emergency, they know what to do with it. I think that is the single most important thing I learned from Uncle James. And uh, I think through his 18 years of experience, I think there are so much to learn from him. So this is just uh, one, one thing that I get that is very, until today, is very impactful. Because that is the single moment that I experienced that changes everything. Uh, so now, my relationship with my tenant is uh, we are like friends. Okay, and any problem they are lost to us, we will find a way to settle for them and we take care of them. So I think 
and most importantly we actually get to know them uh, and if we do not do welcome dinner sometimes they don't even know who is staying next door to them they don't even know their neighbors so i think there's a one of the very powerful things